Hello students, in this session we are going to study about how to remove left recursion and left factoring from the given grammar. Okay? So what is left recursion? First of all, we are going to study how uh, the left recursive grammar is. So if your grammar is in the form of A gives A alpha slash beta then such a type of grammar is known as a left recursive grammar. This type of grammar is known as a left recursive grammar. Here this non-terminal <coughs> and this non-terminal is a same then such a type of grammar is known as a left recursive grammar. So in order to remove this left recursion we need to follow this rule. A gives beta A dash and A dash gives alpha a dash slash epsilon okay so let's have some example first of all my example is if this is my example e gives e plus t slash t t gives t star f slash f f gives opening e closing slash id so as we see in this this production contains the left recursion as this e and this e is same here this t and this t is same then this is contains a left recursion okay so we have to remove this one so consider consider e gives e plus t slash t so as per our formula this is nothing but my a this is nothing but again my a this entire is alpha this entire is a beta okay so we apply formula so a gives beta e dash so what is my a here e so e gives beta beta is nothing but t a dash means this e dash e dash gives alpha the alpha is plus t this entire plus t so plus t e dash slash epsilon epsilon is in the formula only then second one second uh, production is this one that is t gives t star f slash f here we removed the left recursion of e okay so again this one is my a this one is again my a this one is alpha this one is beta okay so again we remove it so t gives first of all beta a dash that is f t dash and t dash gives star f t dash star f t dash slash epsilon star f is alpha t dash slash epsilon so our final grammar without left recursion is final grammar without left recursion is e gives t e dash e dash gives plus t e dash slash epsilon you didn't write this grammar because we solve this grammar and got this one our solution okay then for t also t gives this is our solution solved left recursive grammar t gives f t dash t dash gives star f t dash slash epsilon and here there is a note and not any type of left recursion so that's why f gives opening e closing slash id so this is our final grammar after removing left recursion okay now we'll have a second sum so if i have a sum like this a gives a a then again a b then again d so as this one is a this one is a this is my alpha one this is again a this is again alpha two this is again beta so in this type of sum we have to solve again a gives we'll have beta a dash so we have beta here d so d a dash and a dash gives alpha a dash now there are two alphas alpha one alpha two so first of all we'll take as a alpha one a dash that is a a dash then alpha 2 a dash that is b a dash slash epsilon so this is how we remove the left recursion we'll have another example 
as uh, uh, example is B gives D E D A and again B B. Now as you see here, there is a left recursion in this type here. यहाँ पे रेफ्ट रिकर्शन है ओके सो दिस बी दिस बी इज नथिंग बट माई ए माई ए अल्फा वन अल्फा टू दिस इज माई बीटा वन दिस इज माई बीटा टू सो हम लोग सबसे पहले यहाँ पे क्या लिखेंगे बी गिवज बीटा ए डैश तो देर आर टू बीटा तो फर्स्ट आइट बीटा वन ए डैश दैट इज डी बी डैश बीटा टू ए डैश दैट इज ई बी डैश एंड बी डैश गिवज अल्फा वन दैट इज ए बी डैश alpha 2 that is b b dash slash epsilon okay so this is how we remove the left recursion okay now the second problem is left factoring how to remove left factoring from the given grammar so left factor grammar means like this we'll write here removing left factoring from given grammar as like left recursion mein humne dekha tha ki grammar is of this form a a ye agar same hai aapka first non terminal then this is nothing but left recursion so left factoring is nothing but like this a gives alpha beta alpha gamma if ये प्रोडक्शन का फर्स्ट एंड सेकंड वाले प्रोडक्शन का फर्स्ट अगर सेम है तो दैट इज नथिंग बट लेफ्ट फैक्टरिंग सो इफ यू वांट टू रिमूव दिस दिस इज अ सॉल्यूशन ए गिवज अल्फा ए डैश एंड ए डैश गिवज बीटा स्लैश गैमा ओके विल हैव एन एग्जांपल सपोज आई हैव दिस एग्जांपल इज एस गिवज ए ए बी बी स्लैश ए ए बी डी ये एग्जाम्पल है यहाँ पे मेरे पास एंड अगेन हम यहाँ पे लेते हैं ए गिवज ए ए स्लैश ए डी एंड बी गिवज इज बी ए डी स्लैश बी ए स्लैश एफ ओके नाउ देखो यहाँ पे ए ए बी ऑफ दिस वन ए ए बी ऑफ दिस वन इज सेम ये सेम है तो ये हमारा हो गया अल्फा ये हो गया अल्फा तो ये हो गया बीटा ये हो गया गया सो कंसिडर एस गिवज ए ए बी बी स्लैश ए ए बी डी सो दिस इज अल्फा बी दिस इज अल्फा ये हो गया बीटा दिस इज अल्फा दिस हो गया गैमा तो अकॉर्डिंग टू आर फॉर्मूला अल्फा ए डैश दिस इज माई अल्फा अल्फा क्या है हमारा ए ए बी ए डैश मीन्स एस डैश एस डैश दैट इज गिवज बीटा गैमा बीटा इज बी गैमा इज डी ओके देन फॉर दिस वन ए यहाँ पे देखो अगेन सो यहाँ पे हम लोगों ने ए ए एंड ए डी सो अगेन हम लोग कंसिडर करेंगे यहाँ पे कंसिडर ए गिवज ए ए स्लैश ए डी This is our alpha. This is beta. This is our alpha. This is our gamma. So we'll solve. A gives alpha a dash. So A gives alpha is nothing but what? Small a. So small a a dash and a dash gives beta gamma. So my beta is nothing but capital A and gamma is small d. Capital A and small d. Okay. And for uh, b, b gives b b d. Here I write. consider b gives b b d b a f so small b just a minute b a d so b a d then again b a and then f so this is my alpha this is my beta this is my alpha gamma nahi hai aur ye f kisi se relate nahi karta so in that case b gives alpha a dash that is b a b dash B dash gives beta gamma. My beta is d. Gamma नहीं है तो हम लोग epsilon लिखेंगे. And as this f is not relate with any alpha, so you write this as it is. So my final grammar after removing left recursion, sorry left factoring, final grammar after 
removing left factoring is as gives as gives a a b s dash a a b s dash s dash gives uh, b slash d then a gives a a dash a dash gives a slash d and uh, b gives b a b dash slash f b dash gives d slash epsilon okay i hope you understood this left recursion and left factoring okay thank you